So I'm doing a little test today. This is a DeWalt heater, a little uh, propane heater using the one pound tanks. We have spots on both sides, but the model of this is the DXH12B. And what I've been testing today is that this little heater has a fan. I don't have any propane hooked up. It has a fan and it has a light. It has USB ports and these are all powered by our friend, the DeWalt 20 volt max battery. Now, right now you see we're flashing. That means that the battery is running low. I started this this morning uh, five hours ago. So the light and the fan have been running for five hours constantly today. And I just was going to show this to you in the back. I'm going to get this a little farther up on the, sh the counter here. Is our battery. Switches, fan, light. Light, light. And of course, you put our battery in here. This can use the 20 volt. It can also use the new batteries, the 40 and the 60 volt, because you can see that there's a lot of space. I used just a regular 3 amp hour 20 volt max battery. And let's see, let's go here and show you. So we still have one battery indicator there, so it'd be able to run a little bit longer. But on a 3 amp hour battery, and I didn't do anything special. This isn't a brand new one, just one that I've been using with my different tools. It ran for five hours today, and then it started fl flashing up there. Again, you've got a cool little device here. I'm going to be using this for ice fishing come this upcoming winter season. We're going to do some tests now where we go and put... put uh, I'm going to get this shut. There we go, clips. We're going to go and we put some tanks in here, run the lights, and run the fan, and see how that works. But on high, this is a... 1200 BTU and I think around a 7000 BTU somewhere in that ballpark and on high we can get about three hours excuse me an hour and a half on on high on a one pound tank and about three hours on low but anyway we'll cover more of that in different videos I just wanted to show you that this is out there and this test was pretty cool getting five hours of run time off the light and fan for more tips and how-to videos go to weekendhandyman.com